going to do a little analysis of the unreleased Sherlock pilot. And then in the left-hand corner, you can see the original one that aired. So right away, obviously, the bigger guy with the glasses. Don't really want to point out too many names because I'll forget them. Um, big characteristics are still wearing that white trench coat. Still looking quite professional. And uh, Watson merely changed his coat from a leather one to a uh, more modern one, I guess you could say. Not too much more than that for costumes, but here in the original, they went to a sit down diner and they're drinking wine and conversing. And then in the newer one, they're on a park bench where they were passerbys and they're drinking coffee. The audio is a lot different on the newer one. However, when you start both of the clips up the way I put them into my program, both audios are almost mirrored exactly. Uh, just on some of the responses are slower, like when he said, I got shot. And then as you can already tell that where they introduced Sherlock, that changed. Time lineups, a little bit different on that one. Still in the same sort of scene. A little bit newer of a hospital on the uh, newer one. The unreleased, they're already on the part where he points out that uh, she now put on lipstick. And then on the bottom one, you could see that they're still trying to converse about whatever he was talking about, about the bruises and all that jazz. Um, okay, this is the one thing I noticed right away. Right now he's emailing, and then he's going to ask for the phone. And then Watson still gives him the phone in both clips. But as you can see, he's in a computer lab of some sort. And he's emailing uh, his brother. And then the other two emails I didn't notice right off the bat. But then on the newer one, he's in a lab. I noticed that right off the bat just because he is... He's doing test samples. He's not emailing anybody, so you don't know that he emailed his brother, even though in the pilot you don't know he emailed his brother. You find out his name later on. But he still points out that he went to war, still points out about a brother, even though if you watch the show, it turns out he had a sister who was an alcoholic. And uh, they converse about the flat. They talk about, hey, okay, bringing coffee is almost at the same exact spot again, which is really awesome kind of lines up with the audio but then he still notices that she took off her lipstick which I heard that's really hard to do for women I don't know as you could tell in the newer one that conversation is pretty much over and then in the top right one they're still talking about that scenery changed a lot music is a lot more better in the newer one uh, and the computer lab and the lab are the biggest biggest eye catchers I figured I'd do a fun one with a green screen rather than just sit and talk to a video or just grab screenshots and make a slideshow. So this one will look a little better. And uh, 221B Baker Street. Afternoon? Or what does he say? I think he says afternoon. Yeah. See you guys. The name is Sherlock Holmes and the address is 221B Baker Street. Afternoon. Afternoon.